Give me a little stone pick. Can't get in y'all's because it's on top of the ground. to my channel thanks so much for tuning in for another video if you're new welcome and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell if you have already subscribed welcome back for today's video i will be doing a product review on some products that swap professionals has come out for natural hair so this is a new line of products for african-american women that have kinky curly natural hair so I'm hoping that I have great results. I'm hoping that my hair likes these products because Suave is not really tailored to African-American women or women with natural kinky curly hair, textured hair. And I don't recall anything in their lines ever being catered to textured hair, which is kind of sad as long as this company has been around and we're just now getting some products for our hair. <laughs> it's kind of sad in a way. I don't want to make this a rant, but I just kind of feel like Suave has been around for so long and they have catered to many women, but not specifically women of color. So I feel like somebody was sitting in an office somewhere like, we're running out of ideas. We need something new. We need something fresh that's going to target a specific group of people that we know is going to jump out there and buy. And that would be us because we are, at least for myself, product chunkies and we just like to go try new things that come out for supposedly natural hair. So I just, I don't know, I just kind of felt some type of way about Swab doing that because I felt like we should have been included in your hair care line all along and not generations later or decades later, now you're coming up with a line specifically for natural hair. I thought that was a little, eh. So they introduced this natural line, which is the Suave Professionals with natural shea butter and pure coconut oil. So these products, of course, the whole line is not all natural. It just may have some natural ingredients in there. So I got the shampoo, I got the conditioner, and I got the leave-in. These were $5 products. I don't know, I don't really have high expectations of these products, but we're gonna give it a go. Let me just break down each of these products and the claims of the products. So let's start with that first, and then we'll get into the washing. Starting with the shampoo, the claims of this product states that it's sulfate free. It's a cleansing shampoo that gently cleanses and moisturizes for natural hair. It's co-created with women with natural hair. And it's got a big stamp on it that says natural hair approved on each of these products. Also on each of these products, it states that there are no sulfates, no parabens, no dyes, and they are color safe. The shampoo is in a 16.5 fluid ounce bottle, as well as the conditioner. The shampoo also states that it removes buildup while infusing hair with moisture and shine. It's infused with natural shea butter known to deeply moisturize and pure coconut oil known to help fight frizz, reduce breakage, and enhance shine. It also states that this product is for curly, coily, and wavy hair. For the conditioner, the product claim states this is a moisturizing curl conditioner. It detangles, softens, and enhances your curls. And specifically, it says this is a buttery conditioner that deeply moisturizes and provides maximum slip so that fingers easily glide through strands to protect against breakage while detangling. It also helps to fight frizz, reduce breakage, and enhance shine. It's also infused with natural shea butter known to deeply moisturize with pure coconut oil. Lastly, I have their Nourish and Strengthen Leave-In Conditioner. The product claim states this is a deep treatment for nourished curls. Just like the shampoo and the conditioner, it also fights frizz, reduces breakage, and enhances shine. It also states that the leave-in conditioner helps to deeply moisturize dry and damaged hair, helping to protect against breakage while detangling. So I have my hair section off into two parts, so we're just going to dive right in with the shampoo. Get about two pumps. washed out I will say that upon using the shampoo I did not feel the moisture 
as I was working the product through my hair. Did it feel cleansing? Yes, it felt very cleansing, a gentle cleanse. Um, it did not feel stripping because after I washed the product out of my hair, which easily washed out of my hair, my hair actually feels pretty soft. So it doesn't feel like it's dried out with any alcohols or anything like that. So it feels really good. It feels very soft and, um, you know, very light and bouncy. So we'll go ahead and move on to the conditioner. Now as far as enhancing my curls, I do see that it, it is defining my curls. My curls are looking kind of plump there with this conditioner. It makes my hair feel very soft. Okay, so I'm gonna wash this out and see if I keep that same moisture in my hair. Okay, so I'm gonna try the Avocado Curl Custard from Natural Club. So it looks like these two products are going to work. So I'm gonna go ahead and start twisting out my hair. So while I do that, enjoy the sounds of the music. So I finished twisting my hair. I will say that my twists are very juicy, very shiny, feel very moisturized. So um, I don't know how the turnout is going to be when I take it down, but so far my twists feel and look really good. So I've already spoke my opinion about the shampoo. The shampoo, eh, it's just a regular shampoo. Nothing spectacular about it. Nothing stands out about it. Um, moisturizing, no. Um, softening, I will say yes when I washed it out. My hair was still soft. Um, but I, I just didn't feel the... It wasn't like a moisturizing it, um, type of a shampoo. It definitely was a cleansing shampoo as it stated. But yeah, moisture, not so much. Um, it was just an okay shampoo. Like I said, I'm not going to ramble on too much about that because it was nothing spectacular about it. Now, as far as the conditioner, I really like the conditioner and I noticed I was working the conditioner in my hair way more than I was the shampoo. So I will say the conditioner is very moisturizing, very softening. Um, it did enhance my curls. So I will say that the product claims are true with this product. Um, when I washed it out of my hair, my hair was still soft. So the conditioner is nice. It, it kind of puts me in the mind of the um, Daily Defense a little bit. It's pretty thick. So that's pretty much all about the conditioner. Not really much to say about it. It's, it's an okay conditioner um, for detangling. I definitely highly recommend it for detangling. The leave-in, um, what can I say about this leave-in conditioner? The leave-in conditioner was softening on my hair wasn't as penetrating as I would like for it to have been on my hair. It was decent. It was okay as far as the leave-in. It's just a little bit too watery for my hair. Um, I don't really care for the watery conditioners, but they're just okay products. I mean, they're five bucks a piece. What more can you expect out of these products at five dollars a piece? But yeah, that's pretty much it. So again, I will come back and I will show you the final results of my hair when it's fully dry. So 
So these are my final results. And I would definitely say it's a lot better twist out than the last twist out that I did. So I'm very well pleased with the outcome. I don't have any uh, flakage. I don't have any residue. My hair still feels very soft. Um, my curls are defined, more defined than, like I said, the last time. So got some great definition. Um, it could be a little bit more shinier than what it was. It, would, it looked very dull, very dry. But nevertheless, it was still soft. Um, moisture? No. <laughs> no moisture. Hair wasn't moisturized at all. I just lost all my moisture, so I had to put some oil in it. But other than that, that's pretty much uh, the video. So I hope you guys enjoy watching me try these products, uh, use these products, speak about these products, and just give you my overall opinion of these products from Suave Naturals or Suave Professionals with natural ingredients or whatever it is but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did don't forget to like comment subscribe also don't forget to check out my amazon store i will leave the link in the description box below so please check that out it's just janine i will see you guys on the next one bye guys